Hi. Today we're steam bending. We have uh, to bend the laths for the sides of the yurt, the, the strips of wood that make the um, structural bone and skeleton of the sides. And they're just going to be better if we bend them. So what we did is create a steam box. So this is a steam box and this is the boiler. This is our steam generation facility. So it's actually a beer keg on top of a ripping hot campfire and there's a little tiny piece of pipe connecting it to a very shoddily constructed box that's quite leaky and allows for circulation and flow of steam. So we're pumping heaps and heaps of steam in there. Um, we're boiling full boil in there and um, we let the, the wood steam for half an hour. We got, you know, some rags to help seal off the leaks, just to get the right amount of leak. And uh, after half an hour, the wood is ripping hot. And you got to move fast. You got about five seconds to work. Well, I guess we're gonna go this way. So we've built this bending jig. So you can see, there's a few on here already. And uh, just pop it in there. And we're gonna leave it for a day or two. And, well, no, about a day, and once it dries out again, first it cools down in the few, first few seconds, and then after about a day, once it's dry, it will hold its shape, hopefully forever. Um, this is my favorite magical process of woodworking, where you, uh, all you're doing is you're playing with the thermoplasticity of the wood by heating it up, allowing the fibers to simply bend. They stretch on one side, and they crush on the other side. And then when it cools down, that's the new shape of your wood. And it will make for a better looking yurt if we bend each one of these just a little bit beforehand.